The software has two coloring tools that will let you experiment with the colors of the design. Let's first look at cycle used colors. This icon takes the existing colors and repositions them in the design. Clicking on the icon again moves the position of the colors again. It is important that you pay attention to where the colors begin so that you will know that you have tried all possibilities. The color wheel lets you choose different color schemes for the design and will change the existing colors to new colors. Make sure you have nothing selected when you click on the color wheel. To choose a color scheme, click on the drop down arrow by Harmonious and you can see that there are all different sorts of color schemes that you can select. Let's return to the harmonious. By clicking and dragging on the circle with the white ring, you can change all the colors in the design. You can also click and drag on any of the individual circles to move those into different areas and change the colors. Nothing has changed in the design until I click OK. I can also make a new color my base color by double clicking on that circle and then by moving that circle it will change all the colors in the design. If you wish to change the brightness of the colors you can click and drag on the slider underneath the color wheel and it will affect the brightness of the color. Again no changes are made to the design until you click OK. Once you've made your changes click OK. To assign thread colors, click on Threads and click on Match All, and all the new colors will be assigned to the default Isochord thread colors. 